What's up team? Uh, today we're gonna be doing a super cool experiment. We're actually gonna be perfecting and testing new things with an old experiment that we did. Spears through a water bag, which was a Nikopedia original experiment. Um, and it, it actually got a lot of views online and people really like it. We did it on Smosh Lab. I did it for the Frost Science Museum live stage show. And we're gonna be doing it on the Today Show. So today what we're gonna be testing is if we can take an iron and actually iron the sides so that we have a cohesive one piece bag as opposed to using duct tape. And we're also gonna be testing different size dowel rods in order to figure out how big and how small uh, of a spear we can actually put through the bag before it starts leaking. But as you guys know, there's only one way to find out. So let's get to test it. Okie dokie, so this part is definitely gonna be part of the experimental process. Uh, what I'm gonna attempt to do here is I'm gonna measure out four and a half feet of a six mil painter's plastic. And then I'm going to, on, on each side, on five inches on each side, I'm going to seal it up with the iron. There's four and a half feet. Now the reason you want to do it like how I'm doing it right here uh, is because you want this thing to be a lot longer than it is wide. So you have tons of space to fold it over if need be. What I mean by that is like it's 10 feet this way. So now we have a giant, you have something that's four feet wide and 10 feet like for a really long time that way, 10 feet. Now with the parchment paper, Right here are these parchment papers, which you use to put little cookies on. Now what I'm gonna do, is I'm gonna measure out how wide I want the, uh, the seal. Now, uh, this is a total guess here, because we've never done this before, um, but I'm guessing four to five inches on each side. I'm just gonna measure out four inches. That way that is our seal all the way around the bag. So I didn't get this idea uh, for myself. I was researching online about how to seal uh, six mil uh, painter's plastic and it was Threadbanger. Uh, what he did is he had put this together to make a giant water blob. And so I was thinking, wow, the giant water blob is almost the exact same thing as the Spears through a water bag experiment. So this is perfect. That way um, when we, ha we hang the water vertically, uh, we don't have to mess around with the duct tape. Uh, it's a perfect seal. So I'll be really interested to see how well the seal works. Uh, we might need to seal it more or less. Um, that's what today's experiment is all about. So let's test it. All right, so that's like our seal. That's where we're gonna put the two pieces of plastic in there. Here's the edge that I wanna seal right here. It's a nice little crease there. So I'm gonna go ahead and place this in. Whoa, who cut that? <laughs> Terrible cut job right there. All right guys, so here's what we've learned so far. Um, it, it really does work. You really have to apply the pressure though. Um, the double parchment paper is probably the thing that you really wanna do. It does get very hot. If I didn't have these gloves on, I can feel it through these gloves. Um, there are certain areas that worked a lot better, uh, but we believe that those areas will also hold. If we look down here, this is nice. This edge, it's very sealed. I'm liking that a lot. All right, so now we have a sealed bag all the way across. Um, it's sealed in multiple areas. Um, down here, up top, left, right, center, straight. Uh, it's our first go at it. We don't know whether it's actually gonna work or not. So um, once we fill it with water, we'll know right away where the weak points are, um, where they aren't. It'll be interesting to see how the water holds. Oh, there's a hole. Tape it. A little hole right there. Yeah, I see there's a little hole in there. Uh, I, bet it's, little holes. I feel like it's about to go. Oh no. You know, I'm gonna turn it off? Oh no. Oh no. It looks like it's just gonna go. There's holes everywhere. I guess we just didn't do it tight enough. I mean, it's holding, I mean, the concept appears to be working. If you look though, I just don't think, we just didn't iron the bag enough in certain areas. I mean, it's leaking, but whatever. Let's just go for it. Let's just try it. It's not leaking that much. All right, here we go. I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can get the small guy first. Here we go. Work. Now I'm gonna go the 
Now, this is just some horrible carving here if we look. All right, terrible carving. Chase. So, I, I don't think this is the one that's gonna work, we'll find out. Work. <laughs> this is huge. Okay, let me see. Alright, let's see what happens. <laughs> it worked actually really well. What? It worked what? super well. Wow. Alright, here's our last one. And then we're gonna try this bag operation. This is humongo. Again. This is humongo. This is the biggest one we have. Three, two, one. Oh my god. <laughs> and all the way through. Wow. Amazing. Ironically, the bigger ones, if you look, the bigger ones are leaking less. I mean, the biggest thing that's leaking right now is the bag itself. But not where the spears are going through. We have enough time, we can do this one more time, so let's give it a shot. All right, we're gonna redo this whole process. We measured out four and a half feet, and this time around, we're gonna iron the sides. We're not gonna iron the bottom. This is looking great. So far, no leaks in the corners. We have a sealed side. Uh, reinforced sides. And in three, two, one. Oh no! I didn't do it very well. <laughs> in, out. In, all the way through. Alright, other guy, in. All the way through. Put this guy in. All the way through. In. All the way through. Oh, I thought, oh my god! I thought the whole I thought the whole thing was breaking. <laughs> I would have been covered in water. Big guy. Here we go. Three, two, in. All the way through. Bam. And in three, two, one. In. Oh god. All the way through. Boom! Shaka laka laka laka. There we go, it worked. Our new design worked really well. I think um, if I were to change anything, I would have added a little more duct tape on the sides beforehand. Uh, the only leaks that we're really seeing right now is well, kind of the bag from the spheres um, and a little bit on the sides, but not a whole lot. This worked perfectly. We added more water, we got a better seal on the side, we're gonna add a little duct tape for the Today Show, and I think we'll be totally good. Also, we got our big spear through um, from our big all the way down to our small. I feel really good about that. Um, if you like this video, go ahead and give us a thumbs up in the comment section below. Let me know! Were you like, what? I didn't think you are going to be able to get that big giant spear and I can't believe you did the water blob. But uh, vertical, it worked out super well. If you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys really soon.